welcome to Arabesque Agenda, the show that will let you know all the arts and culture events from the Middle East communities happening here in the UK and the Middle East. First up, let's take a look at what's on in the UK. A dark and comedic story from Egypt, excuse my French, is hitting the cinemas in London. It is the story of Hani Abdallah Peter, who after the death of his father that leaves the family in debt, is forced to leave the safe surroundings of his private school for a public one. Things get complicated as he's forced to hide his Christian religion after confusion of his name makes his peers mistake him for a Muslim. <laughs> The film will be followed by talks with the Egyptian director Amr Salama and will screen at the Leighton House Museum on Wednesday the 26th of November. For, for tickets and information just click on to rbkc.gov.uk slash museums. Discover a completely new generation of DJs and mixed music in the Mosaics Festival at the Rich Mix in East London. There will be the music of Malian Gryad from Deba Demba, Arabic rock from Marseille with Temenic Electric and Acid Arab DJs remixing Middle Eastern trance with techno, all made in France. Check these new and exciting styles of music on Friday the 28th of November. To get your tickets, go to institutefrancais.org.uk. Three writers, two actresses, and a band bring music, poetry, and literature from the Syrian uprising to Chelsea Theatre. It is readings from the new anthology Syria Speaks, Art and Culture from the Frontline that will take place. It will showcase the new writing which documents and interprets the momentous changes that have shifted reality so drastically in Syria. The live readings and music event will take place on Tuesday, 18th of November at the Chelsea Theatre in West London and you can get your tickets at northfestival.eventbrite.co.uk. Now, let's take a look at what's up in the Middle East. Partaking in a massive message to the world, artists from Gaza will be exhibiting art and photography work at the Zara Centre in Amman, Jordan. It is the exhibition Testimonials of Our Existence, where 45 artists from Gaza are partaking in the message by exploring their daily lives through testimonials of their very own existence and coexistence. You can check out the exhibition up until Tuesday, 2nd of December. And for more information, just go to facebook.com slash Zara Center. exhibition has opened up in Beirut depicting the city and its heartbeat through photography. It's photographer George Haddad who through his photography has captured an essence of the city's heart and transformed it into his exhibition Beirut is that you. Shown at the Ramal Gemaize gallery the show promises to give a beautiful glimpse of the city through the lights, dust and air. The exhibition goes on until Thursday 20th of November and for more information just click onto the Facebook page facebook.com slash Haddad photo. Now let's take a look at this week's recommended arabesque episode. The amazing and heart-wrenching documentary by the filmmaker Leila Sansur, Open Bethlehem, will feature in our newest episode of Arabesque. Leila, originally from Bethlehem, returned to her hometown to do what she first intended, make a small film about the trip back. The small film stretched out and 10 years later it has become a feature documentary and a whole movement trying to raise awareness about the wall that is being built there and the difficulties of the everyday life. Tune in to catch our exclusive interview with Leila and see the first UK screening ever on levant.tv slash arabesque. Thank you for joining us. We hope your diary will allow you to visit one of these wonderful works and that you will have a great evening. See you next week for more tips on where to see the best events from the Middle East and North African communities here in the UK and in the Middle East. Until then, take good care.